you know, some of those new homes that you see being built in some of these neighborhoods, they have like this ability to leave a package and leave it behind something. Like I, that's the one thing I, I get yes. so worried about when you get something from Amazon or whatever it might be. The package is just there waiting for somebody to steal it. Imagine if you could use mm -hmm. technology to make sure that that package is going to be safe and waiting for you when you get home. Well, our next guest is taking care of that for you. Yeah, he's thought a lot about it, as a matter of fact. Ron Carter is the founder and CEO of One Ahead Technologies. Joining us now to talk all about tech and home security. Ron, welcome to the show. It's so nice to meet you. Well, thank you for having me. You bet. Say, um, let's just start start with home security and tell us a little bit about your background because you have years in the industry and you've been involved in a lot of different uh, products. Well, you know, and then I'll age myself tremendously. Um, I began my career in city government and retired in 2004 and developed a device to assist my mom who'd had hip surgery to see who was at the door. And back in 2003, if you remember, we were still in a stage called dial-up. So the technology worked. However, it took a day to get an image. <laughs> and so, yeah. um, you know, I realized that it was just a matter of time we would have the ability to stream. And so the solution predated the technology by about four or five years. And that enabled me to secure the patent. And uh, so now, today, we know that technology... Um, Probably the most successful brand in the marketplace is a brand called Ring. But every um, security company has some type of video surveillance device. Yeah. And while well, you're seeing cameras uh, almost at every front door nowadays, it's very, uh, everyone's worried about Big Brother. We were the brother. Whatever the case, you know, I have cameras with, I have a security camera right there. I got one behind me. There's all over the place. Gee. You have an invention that you're going to be releasing at CES, which, by the way, we're excited that's finally coming back. That's going to blow Yay. people's minds. Can you can you let us in and let us know a little bit about what we're going to see? Oh, yeah, we're very excited. Um, we've taken the technology just a step further. We have introduced artificial intelligence into the component as one of the features, uh, perhaps the foundational feature that will enable the technology to do far more than just a dormant type uh, video doorbell. Then we also introduced a uh, component that allows you to simply take a picture or use an image for access. Um, mm -hmm. You can pull an image from your phone. You can take a picture of, um, of your friend or one of your children or your dog. And when that image is displayed at the door, it will provide you access. What's unique mm -hmm. about that is that uh, for ages, we've always had metal keys or an access to that's based on uh, what's called near field communication where the images are close in proximity. But uh, for the first time, we we're using an image reader that can actually read an image. Um, just to give you an idea, my engineer was just toying around and uh, took a picture of his uh, big toe. And I'm like, what in the world is this? He, said, he says, I know that this can't be duplicated. and." Um, you know, um, you know, just joking around, but that's another feature of the technology. Well, uh, Last but not least, yeah. Mm -hmm, go ahead. Yep. No, I was going to say keys. Yeah, no. I mean, there, there's there's bumps. There's like five or six bumps in a key. You can fish that out in thirty seconds. Get inside a key. You can't find mm -hmm. that picture of the big toe that was just taken and put to the. You can't just find that on the internet. If you send it to that one person, that's like the one key in the world. Absolutely, and right. it doesn't have a digital footprint, so it yeah. goes. Well, as a toe print. It essentially go way print. beyond yeah. our technology. Um, but last but not least, what we're most excited about is um, we have integrated robots with the uh, entry management system, which will enable, for the first time in history, an opportunity to mitigate a threat, as opposed to just simply receive an alarm or video image. We call the mm -hmm. alarm a notification. And the image is just a verification. So the camera and the alarm for ages we've called security, and yeah. it's not been security. So um, with the integration of robot, particularly an aerial robot, which we call a drone, um, now we're able to um, kind of begin to mitigate crime, mitigate events. And uh, mm. so that's what we're most excited about. So in this one device, you have support for e-commerce and um, 
and mail order. Mm -hmm. And you also yep. have a, a new access capability that's net networkable, um, where let's say you have the plumber coming by, you can just simply send him a key and then the security all in one package. Nice. It could really change our lifestyles. Ron, thank you so much for joining us. We've run out of time. Real quick oh. before we go, when when is uh, this product going to be available? Yeah, we're hoping to bring it online the uh, fourth quarter of 2022. You know, unfortunately, we've run into uh, delays with chipsets and things oh, of that yeah. nature. Chips so are hopefully hard to come that doesn't delay us too long, but we're, we're excited about bringing it online in 2022. I'll tell you, you know what, there, were, there was an old AT&T commercial from way back in the day. They're like, in the future, you'll do this and you'll do that. And 40 yeah, years hi. later, like it's all coming true. And then some. It's incredible what you've done. Congratulations. And uh, we look forward to nice seeing it. Nice to meet you. Seeing it, uh, oh, in the, it's been my pleasure. Thank you for having me. All right. Take care of yourself. If you want to learn more about One Ahead Technologies, go to oneaheadtechnologies.com.